Hello and welcome to Ban in a Box 2025 for Mac. This video is part of our bootcamp series of videos where we take a particular task in Ban in a Box and show you how it's done and also show off some new features in the program along the way. So in this video, I'm going to show off the new AI Lyrics Generator feature. This feature can be accessed in the Multipicker Library window, and it features creative songwriting functions that suggest or generate themes, styles, titles, and even entire song ideas. It also offers customized AI lyrics generation, allowing you to create lyrics from scratch, generate the next line, or experiment with rhymes, synonyms, antonyms, related words, or alliterations. You can enhance your existing lyrics by adding vivid imagery, emotion, richer vocabulary, or more natural phrasing. So I have a slow Americana song that I just entered the chords for, and now I'm gonna use the AI Lyrics Generator feature to add lyrics to this song. So first of all, the AI Lyrics feature can be accessed from a new tab in the multi-picker, but you can also access it just by typing, as if you were typing a chord, A-I-L, enter. So first, I'll explore this window a bit. There are six AI Lyrics modes that you can use here, which you select from this menu. And I'll go through all of these in a little bit, but first I'll just show you all of the elements of the entire dialog. This area here displays the function of whichever of those six modes you're in. Every one of those modes has a generate button like this. And then this middle area gives you the AI response when you press generate. And this AI response area remains constant no matter which mode you switch to. This user scratch pad area also remains consistent regardless of which mode you're in. And this is basically just a big text field that you can enter text in. And this text gets saved with the current Ban in a Box song file. So the Americana style and chord progression that I just put together here has kind of a plaintive sound. So I think maybe I'm gonna try and write some lyrics about missing an old friend. So maybe I'll just put my initial lyric theme idea here right now. I miss you, my old friend. So that's what I'm just gonna start off with for this song. Continuing on through the various elements of this dialogue, here we have the common elements area. Again, this remains constant no matter what mode you're in. Really, the only thing that changes when you change the AI lyrics mode is this area up here. So with this common elements area, every time you press generate, regardless of what mode you're in, it's gonna take data from this area into account. So as I mentioned before, this is a song about missing an old friend. So I'll enter that as the theme of the song. For genre, I'll put Americana. The default for language is English, so I don't need to enter anything here, but you certainly can write in other languages, and this is where you'd enter that info. And the only lyric fragments I have right now is what I entered in the scratch pad. So I'll just paste that in here as well. So that now every time I press generate, it will take all of these things into consideration. So now I'll go through all of the various modes, starting with word phrase suggestions. So first of all, if you've already got some lyrics in mind, you might just want to use this as a rhyming dictionary. And you can type text here, but since this auto input field is selected, when I highlighted the text in the scratch pad, it just automatically entered that here. If instead I just highlight my old friend, then that gets entered in. And I'll press generate. And you can see there are lots of options that it's given me here. And you can have it make other suggestions as well. For example, alliteration. And now it's given me a bunch of alliteration options that start with M, since my old friend also started with an M. The next mode is the songwriting assistant, which is more or less freeform AI. As I mentioned before, the data in common elements gets taken into account every time you press generate. So I could enter additional information here, 
but I'll just go with the suggested let's get started and see what it gives me if I press generate. So since the common area had Americana as a genre, the AI response explains that Americana is often a storytelling kind of genre. And then it's giving me some great suggestions of stories then based on missing an old friend with themes including longing and reunion. And it's giving me some great ideas to start with. For this second one here, this one's kind of speaking to me. Highlight how time and distance have changed things, but not the bond. So that would kind of be the theme of the song. And here it's already giving me some lyric ideas. So I think I'm going to scrap what I have already and go from this. So I'm going to copy that and put it in the lyrics fragments. And this part here, I'm going to copy that and paste that as the theme of the song. I'll also take that lyric fragment and put it in the user scratch pad as well. So now I'm going to continue exploring through the other modes. Custom is even more free form. You can ask questions here in whatever way you want. A lot of what you can do in the other windows can also be done here, but with a more ad lib approach. With the inspiration mode, you can generate song themes, titles, or even entire song ideas. With lyric improvements, you can refine, rewrite, extend, or add to your lyrics. And then finally, full song lyrics is exactly what it sounds like. This mode can generate complete song lyrics matching a specific form, the number of lines per section, and other details. And I think I'm going to use this mode right now. That one little bit of lyrics from an earlier suggestion is already now in the common elements, along with the genre and the theme. The song I worked on earlier has an A, A, B, A form, so that's what I'm going to enter here. So now I have to enter a value for lines per section. So one section would be, for example, the, these eight bars here. So let me just play a little bit of it and I'm gonna think about sort of what I want the melodic rhythm to be. So just as far as syllables go, I would think I would want it to be something like da 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 and that would be one line of text there. So four lines per section actually makes sense because you'd have a line here, a line here, a line here, and a line here, and that makes up the whole section. And with the syllables, I was saying, I think one line is maybe eight to 10 syllables. I'll go medium, five to eight syllables. So I think I'm gonna use this mode right now. It will take all of these elements into account and it will generate the entire song. All right, and I kind of like what it came up with here. Now let me play a bit of the song again, and maybe I'll just speak these words with each line covering two bars. Years have passed like rivers flow, miles in between where wildflowers grow. Yeah, so that seems to fit this perfectly. So I'm going to take the entire thing and put it in the user scratch pad. I'm going to press Command S to save this file. And as I mentioned before, the text in this scratch pad area will be saved with the song. 
so I could come back to it at a later time and continue to edit and refine. For example, say I didn't like the line, time's gentle hand won't turn the tide. So I want to replace that with something else. I could take the line immediately before it, copy it to the clipboard, go back to the word phrase suggestions, go to rhymes. That text is already entered in here because of the auto input selected text from Scratchpad. And so I'll press generate and see if it comes up with some ideas for the next line that I like better. So here are some suggestions. And maybe I like this one better. So I'll paste it in. So now the last thing I want to do is actually have all of these lyrics in the lyric layer in the bars right above the chords in the chord chart. And this is actually really easy to do. So first of all, I'm going to go and turn on that layer. Chord display, layers, bar lyrics. So you can see that's added a faint blue line above the chords here. And that's where text can be added. Now, lyrics can be copied and pasted quite easily into the lyric layer, as long as each line in the text you're copying corresponds with each bar, with empty lines meaning there will be no lyrics in that bar. So if you recall from before, I was considering each of these lines to correspond with two bars of music. So I'll just have to do a little bit of editing in the scratch pad here to make it so that each of these lines corresponds to a single bar. So basically, wherever there's a comma, I will just add a return. All right, so now I'm gonna copy all of that to the clipboard and I'll paste it in the lyric layer. And now we have the lyrics entered and saved right in our song. We hope you enjoyed this video on the new AI lyrics generator feature in Bananabox 2025. Thanks for watching and have fun.